I planned on picking up the Wii Zapper gun for use with House of the Dead so I could blow up some zombie heads. And I, for I forget what it cost. It was like 25 bucks or something. But I saw that it came packed in with a game called Lynx Crossbow Training. Link, of course, is the hero of the Zelda series by Nintendo. I assumed that this was just some throwaway pack-in piece of trash that they put in with the Wii Zapper gun to make it look like you get a little bit more for your money than just a molded piece of plastic that you insert your Wii controller into, which, for the most part, you don't even need to play gun games. But I paid for it, I figured I'd give it a try. I inserted Link's crossbow training into the Wii. I would have really preferred it be called Link's assault rifle training, to be honest with you. I was pleasantly surprised to find that Link's crossbow training is worth the full price of the Wii Zapper Gun. As far as I'm concerned, the Zapper Gun comes with this game. You can say a lot of things about Nintendo, but they've always got solid technical production value on their games. And this game is very well made. It has a lot in it as well. It has a number of different crossbow training challenge levels. Everything from target shooting to to riding on horses and shooting targets. Most of it's target shooting, but there's a couple in there where you sort of wander around environments and shoot spiders or, or monsters or whatever. It's very kid-friendly, hence the whole crossbow thing, because a crossbow somehow seems less lethal than an AK-47. But that's not true. I've seen crossbows, and they can do quite a bit of damage, just not as much. There's nine levels total, each broken into three stages. The scoring is heavily based on combos, meaning you don't miss anything. Missing is very bad. You're better off not shooting at all than missing, because when you miss, you break your combo. That's pretty, that's consistent throughout the whole game. You see the little multiplier pop up on screen after I shoot something. If it says times 30, that means I've shot 30 things in a row. And if it's a 100 point object on screen that I've shot, it's 100 points times 30. If you really want to get big scores in this game, you have to shoot a lot of things without missing. Whether you're shooting targets or monsters, doesn't matter. Don't miss. The more points you score, the better you do, you get medals and after the first three levels, you then have to unlock the remaining, uh, the remaining five. I think this game is terrific and has wonderful replay value. It keeps track of your high scores. Each time you play through a level, it'll tell you if you did better or worse on each stage. And if this is the only game you get for your Wii Zapper, this should keep you occupied for a while. Link's crossbow training is very smooth, and as I mentioned, very well produced. Everything looks great. It, it really transports you into this fictional realm. And at one point, Link's crossbow even turns into an automatic assault rifle. When you're really desperate, that's actually terrible for combo scoring, but... If you're eyeing up the Wii Zapper add-on for your Wii, 
to play other games, other shooting games. I believe that it's worth the price because you get this game with it. And the, and the Wii Zapper is also a nice add-on. I have that reviewed in a separate video. So that's Link's Crossbow Training. Not just another drink coaster. Actually a good game.